Hey Jack. What are you up to? We're playing school Mr. Drawer. Cool. Well here's your camera Jack. Thanks Mr. Drawer. Two plate rents hits. We gotta find a hand print. Oh a hand print. Right. And that's our first hint. A hint. A hint. And then we take a picture with our camera. Because they're Trent's hits. Trent's hits. We gotta find another handprint. That's the second hit. We take a picture with our camera. Because they're whose hints? Trent's hits. We gotta find another handprint. That's the third hit. We take a picture with our camera because they're Trent's hits. Trent's hits. You know what to do. Sit down in our special couch. And think, think, think. Because when we use our minds take a step at a time we can do anything. We that we want to do. You know, I'm really gonna need your help today. Figuring out where we're gonna go on the bus. Will you help me? You will? Great. It's story time. Oh, it's story time. Come on. There you are, Jack. You're just in time for story time. Yeah. It's story time. Do you want to pick out a book for us to read, Jack? Sure thing, Teacher Trent. Let's see what's in the bookshelf. Ah, here's a good one. This story is called, Telling Time with Goofy. Let's begin now. Goofy woke up and turned on the radio beside his bed. The time is now 8 o'clock, the announcer said. Oh no. Goofy shouted. I'm late. I'm late. Clothes flew everywhere as Goofy got dressed. He was in such a hurry. He put his shirt on backward and put his head through the armhole of his vest. Great story, Jack. I agree. It was all about Goofy learning how to tell time. Good story, Jack. I love it. Thanks, Teacher Trent, Doof, and Rosie. Come on. Let's go find some hints. <laughs> 